Today's video, I've been getting a lot of questions about how do you change a breaker out of your panel in your home? Well, you're in luck. Today we're going to cover that on a two pole uh, 30 amp circuit breaker, 230 volt. Uh, we want to make sure that we've got our breaker turned off. I want to show you a couple of tools that we use here. Uh, this is just an induction tester. And basically that tester is one that will pick up when the green light's on, safe, good to go. But if you want to go in, a little more insurance on it, We've got this Fluke uh, voltmeter that I like it a lot better. Uh, we use that to check the wires coming out of the breaker. So, first of all, make sure the power's off, make sure it's safe, and we're ready to go forward with removing our wires and circuit breaker. All right, so now we've got our breaker turned off. The one we're going to change out is a two-pole breaker. It's 230 volt. We're going to double check and make sure that no power's coming out of it. We do have our main breaker on, so these bus rails will remain hot here. So you must use caution there. All right, we're going to take the breaker with it in the off position. We're going to show you how you just basically remove the wires that you're going to pull out. Just loosen those. Being careful that once you take this out, it doesn't fly back into the panel. I always like to bend them back. Get them out of the way there safely. And once you get your other screw loose, pull your other 110 wire out bend it back out of the way. Always have the breaker off when putting in and removing from the panel. Now grab the breaker, just pivot out. You'll notice that it has these two notches. These notches go with this track system. In this back portion, these are the terminals that are going to hit the spades inside the panel. That's where it picks up 110 from each side of the panel. 110 to each side of the breaker gives you 230. All right, so that was simple enough. We've got our new breaker. We're ready to put it back in. So now we're going to grab that puppy, make sure that our hooks line up in the back, and just reverse it and pivot in. Once we pivot it in, we're going to reinstall our wires. Just basically reverse the order. Make sure you get those back in behind the clip. Sometimes they can be a little tricky. Put your red wire in there. You want to tighten those down good and snug. You don't want to over tighten them. Reinstall the second one. Tighten them down. All right, wires are reinstalled. We re energize the breaker and we've got power coming out. So that's how easy it is to remove and safely reinstall a circuit breaker in your home. Okay, want to make sure that we touch on safety as always. The panel that we used in the video was a demonstration panel only. It was not live, so I moved kind of quick through the tutorial. But when you're working in and around a panel, please use caution. Don't be scared of it, but just be cautious of it. Also, you want to make sure that you have a good voltmeter or an induction tester, a probe, to pick up any voltage that may be present in the panel. If you have any questions, just leave it in the comment section below. As always, we ask that you would like us, follow us, and subscribe to our channel. And as always, thank you so much for your support, and God bless.